Hi, y'all. It's me. Um, I just got home from work at Michael's. Um, actually, today was crop day, and, well, nobody shows up as usual, so I was by myself. Um, but I didn't mind. It gave me a chance to work on all my truth cards. So I got all my truth cards finished up, and I just need to seal them with a um, spray sealer, which I bought tonight. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and get those out of the way. And I hope you guys make them. Please, please participate. My goodness gracious, I made these in like an hour. It's not take very long at all. And it means like the world to these women. If you could just find it in your schedule and your heart and your time and the printouts are free and I mean I hope everyone participates that's all anyway um I want to show you some paper pads I got lately um actually I got most of them tonight but I I got this one um um this week at Joann's because it was half off so I picked up the Magnolia Way which I'm sure by now most of you have probably seen it but I will flip through it really quickly for those who may not have um, it's really pretty. That one's aligned. It's pretty bright in color. Some of the pages are shiny. I love that one. I love these two. This one has script in the back. Pretty nice. Oops. Sorry. I'm trying to. I don't want to miss any. In case you're interested, you can go hunt it down. It has nice little tags and stuff you can cut out. I love this one too, even though it's um, really light color, but it looks like lace. It's so pretty. And that one. Oops. Oops. Sorry, my stamp is getting in the way. Surrounded by stamps. <laughs> um, another mind. And this is my favorite one. All these beautiful butterflies, and they're all shiny. They're very, very, very pretty. So that one's called Magnolia Way, and this one is at Joann's. And today was their last day, I believe, of their 50% off. So then, um, okay, so today at Michael's, <laughs> I was only planning on buying one stack because there was one in particular I really wanted. So when I got there, I was digging, and I was digging, and I could not find the one I wanted, which bummed me out but oh my gosh you guys there was so many paper stacks I'd never seen before um so I'm going to show you the ones I picked up now this one you guys have probably seen by now but this was the Heidi Swap um Sugar Chic and um I'm not a big fan of like a lot of the animal prints but I do like all the other the other um papers in here I just think they're they're so fun and playful and I have an embossing folder that matches that one and I love this one. It's gorgeous. I saw it in the file folders and I was like, darn, I love a paper like that. And there I have it. Yay. Um, there's another one I really like in here too. Well, I like a lot of them, so I'm not I'm not displeased. I like most of them. It's just the animal ones that I'm I'm not as fond of. I'm sure they have stuff on top. I'm probably not even seeing the whole paper. This one I love. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my goodness gracious. And there's another one, I think, too, if it's in this stack. These have um, letters and journaling cards and more journaling cards and more journaling cards. <laughs> like, you can, so many things you can cut out and play with. So, anyway, that one's called Sugar Chic. So then um, there's new die cuts with a view. There's new um, recollections. So I was going down the row, and the next one I came upon was this one which is called fabulous girl and i hadn't seen this one either before um i'm assuming or well, i'm this kind of looks to me like um simple stories paper pad collection so um you know i'm not sure maybe it is who knows <laughs> it looks like it to me the colors even resemble their kind of colors because they're muted brights kind of so um have a look it's so cute i just I couldn't pass it up. I just, I love simple stories, but I don't always want to pay the price for their, pa you know, packs. And then you get one of each. And this, I know, is not as thick. And you only get, you know, a couple of each. But at least you get a couple of each, and you don't have to choose what side you want to use, which I love. Wait till you see the journaling cards in this thing. It's crazy. These are so pretty. If you haven't 
They have, like, I think there must have been 14 stacks there I've never seen before. These are all the cutout things you can cut out. Bingo cards. All the little words. Look at how much stuff is in here to play with. So cute. So see what I mean? It looks like simple stories to me. So anyhow, that one's by Recollections called Fabulous Girl. And then the next one I got, also I'd never seen before, and it looks like simple stories. And um, this one's called Memories Documented. And I'm not always one to go towards these colors, but I really like this. I really like this particular collection. So let me share this one. loving this I love it and I really like it um I can see it mixed with other brighter colors so it's kind of what I had in my head when I when I purchased it but I really like it my fingers hurting from flipping the pages these cut here come all the cutouts I even think some of these would look cute with um romance novel maybe I don't know. I just, but it's, they're so cute. Isn't that crazy? This looks just like simple stories. So this one again is called Memories Documented and it's Recollections. And then finally, as I was walking around for the night, I happened upon some more stacks of paper and I was going through them and I found the one I wanted yay and I only had one <laughs> and this one's die cuts with a view and it's called the primrose and I love it it's right up my alley it's so pretty I just love this it's got die cut sheets in here that you could cut out and I love when they mix roses and text like that or just I love it and this is ledger Look at how cute the little birdie there. Sorry, I have to go this way because my you wouldn't see it. Oh, I love this one. So pretty. This one's got some ledger and roses on this side. Oh, there's another one that's so pretty. The little birdie with the crown. There's some more cutouts. Oh, I love this stack. I wish they'd had another one. I probably would have not gotten one of the other ones and bought two of these just to have one. It's a chandelier. These you could cut apart too. And more tags. Isn't it pretty? Oh my gosh, I love this one. So again, this one is called the Primrose and it's die cuts with a view. And then the last two things that I have to share are, I bought a stamp. Um, this one I got a couple days, well, last time, or I don't think I've shown it, but I thought it was so cute, and it was on clearance for $3.99, and um, greetings to you, and it's so cute. I'd never seen this stamp before, so I, I picked that up, and in the same theme of the hot air balloon, I found this in the clearance section. I'd never seen these before either. It's a hot air balloon charm. <laughs> it's so cute. It's all sparkly with nice pretty colors and it was two dollars in the clearance section. So really cute. So anyhow, that's all I have to share with you. Please do your truth cards. Please, oh please, oh please. Means a lot to the ladies. And thanks so much for watching and good luck finding the stacks and be on the lookout because there's way more. I've, there's some I didn't even get, but there's way more. So have a look at Michael's. Talk to you soon. Bye.